Kayak Fishing Tales is brought to you by Seaguar, always the best in fluorocarbon, braid, and monofilament fishing lines. Introducing the new Threadlock Ultra Strong 16 Strand Hollow Core Braid and the new Smackdown Ultra Strong 8 Strand Braid. Learn more at Seaguar.com. Hi, I'm Jim Samus from the Kayak Fishing Show. Today I'm going to give you a few tips on how to better survive in the surf. Well, the first thing that's going to happen is if you're going to be spending time in that surf zone, you want to make sure you've got the proper protection. First off, a helmet. You get pitched in the surf, you get hit by a 75 pound boat, that's going to protect you. A wetsuit. Now, if the water's warm, you may not necessarily need this, but it does give you a little bit extra protection. I've got this nice body glove wetsuit and it's very flexible so I can paddle really well in it. It gives me the warmth that also protects my body if, again, if I get hit by the uh, kayak. Of course, your number one piece of gear will be your PFD. I've got a Coca's Hat PF PFD here. The nice thing about it, besides just keeping you afloat, it gives you rib protection if your kayak hits you. So always wear that PFD. So basically, one of the big reasons people get into trouble in the surf zone is the boat turns sideways, the leading edge gets caught, and they get pitched towards the beach and then the kayak gets them in the back of the head. Another reason for the helmet. I'm gonna show you a few ways to keep that leading edge up and a couple of things you can do to practice bracing. Bracing is the key, leaning into the wave, lifting the leading edge of the boat so you don't get dumped and get knocked in the head. So basically what happens, your kayak gets sideways in a wave, the leading edge of the boat drops and it'll pitch you towards the beach. So what you wanna do is get your paddle, put the flat of the blade into the wave and lean on it. It's kind of like a shock absorber. You're pushing down and lifting up, pushing down, lifting up, depending on how hard you have to lean. Now, one of the ways you can practice this without actually having to go out into the big water is just get your kayak out into the white water, turn your kayak sideways in the white water and let waves hit you. And each time it hits you, get that, kayak, that paddle out there. Okay, get that paddle into the wave and lean on it. If you can brace from a dead stop, you'll find it's a lot easier to do it once you get moving. Where bracing really comes into play is if you've mis kind of mistimed things and you accidentally caught a wave. You come in and the boat turns. Now, I am much better bracing going to the left. So I generally try to force my boat to the left. If I know I'm catching that wave, I'll force the boat to the left. It's already in that position going that way, so I can brace to that side. You drag in your paddle and lean on it. That's a few techniques to help you survive in the surf. For outstanding customer service, expert advice, and an extensive selection of quality kayak fishing products, visit Hook One at kayakfishinggear.com.